Hello, I'm Will Harris from Advantix. Today, I want to show you how to perform PNA fish for rapid identification of bacteria and yeast from positive blood cultures. There are four basic steps, and it's very straightforward. Once a blood culture signals positive, a gram stain is performed, and based on the gram stain result, the appropriate PNA fish test is performed. For example, if the gram stain reveals gram positive cocci and clusters, the Staph aureus CNS PNA fish test will be performed. Or, if the gram stain reveals gram-negative rods, the E. coli P. aeruginosa PNA fish test will be performed. Advantix offers kits that cover all major categories of bloodstream pathogens, including staphylococci, enterococci, gram-negative rods, and candida species. Let's take a look at how to perform PNA fish. To perform PNA fish, the following materials and equipment are required. A fluorescence microscope equipped with a 60x or 100x oil objective. A PNA fish starter system, which includes a PNA fish workstation, a water bath, staining dishes, and a dual band filter for the fluorescence microscope. Other items required are a 250 milliliter graduated cylinder, a five milliliter pipette, sterile tips, deionized or distilled water, peony fish microscope slides, cover slips, and a PNA fish kit with corresponding control slides. Each kit has enough reagents for 50 tests and includes a bottle of fixation solution, a bottle of PNA probe, a bottle of 60x concentrated wash solution, and a bottle of mounting medium. Before you begin, be sure to review the package insert for complete instructions. Make sure the PNA fish workstation and water bath are switched on and set to 55 degrees Celsius. Next, prepare the wash solution. Add four milliliters of 60X wash solution to a staining dish, along with 240 milliliters of deionized or distilled water. Add the cover and preheat in the 55 degrees water bath. If a gram-negative PNA fish test is used, prepare a staining dish for the water rinse. Add 240 milliliters of deionized or distilled water to a staining dish. Add the cover, label it water rinse, and preheat in the 55 degrees water bath. And lastly, remove the mounting media bottle from the kit and allow it to warm to room temperature. Label slides with sample identifier and the appropriate gram stain result. Add one drop of fixation solution to the well of each microscope slide. If testing gram negative samples, be sure to use the GN fixation solution. The GN fixation solution bottle has a red cap. Then transfer 10 microliters or one small drop of the blood culture to the drop of the fixation solution. Mix gently with a sterile tip to emulsify. Next, place the slides on the peony fish workstation and heat at 55 degrees for 20 minutes. And that's step one. Open the control slide for the corresponding PNA fish tests used. Add one drop of PNA probe to each well of the sample and control slides. Add cover slips to each well. Press firmly on the cover slips to ensure even coverage of the well and to remove any air bubbles. 
play slides on the Peony Fish workstation, and hybridize at 55 degrees for 30 minutes. That's step two. If testing gram-negative samples, immerse slides in 55 degrees water rinse and carefully remove cover slips. Remove slides from water rinse and then place gram-positive and yeast slides in slide rack. Immerse slides in wash solution and gently remove any remaining cover slips. Wash slides at 55 degrees for 30 minutes. After the wash, remove the slides and allow them to air dry. Once dry, add one drop of mounting medium to each well along with the cover slip. Push on the cover slip to remove any excess mounting medium and ensure the cover slips sit in place over the wells. The slides are now ready for examination. Add a drop of immersion oil to each cover slip. Start by examining the positive and negative controls, followed by the sample slides. A positive result is determined by visualization of multiple bright fluorescent cells in multiple fields of view. A negative result is determined by the lack of fluorescent cells. And that's PNA Fish. It's a straightforward, four-step process which is easy and quick to perform.